creepy places you don't want to visit. That's what we're doing here. I'm me, Nathan, musician mortician. You're you, you. I'm glad you're here. Let's dive in. Takakana Numa Greenland Amusement Park. Say it really fast three times. Before you do that, be sure to subscribe. Click the bell to be notified when I release content exclusive here on YouTube. I love all things paranormal, and this has it. Takakana Numa Amusement Park. It's, it's said to be the site of a ton of fatalities and tragic events. There is this eerie mist that is said to appear at this amusement park, and it's not recognized on maps, like especially GPS maps, like the satellite maps. Apparently, it's not something that pulls up all the time. Pretty interesting. I don't know how that's possible because you take the side. Nonetheless, it is a place riddled with eerie paranormal activity, and that's all the ingredients that I love and this channel loves because we love the paranormal. We love the unknown. We love things that you can't explain. And you're like, what the hell are you doing, Nathan? Well, people ask me, Nathan, what do you do in your spare time? Well, I love crime podcasts. I love learning about crimes that have not been solved over the years, the decades, the centuries even. I love the paranormal. I love the unknown. And there's this beautiful parallel with death, life, music, unknown, paranormal. That's why you're here. Let's do it. Number two, Cinco Saltos, Argentina. This lake is the place in which an infant was drowned, and this infant is said to haunt, which would be absolutely scary to think about. Now, the thought of someone hurting, harming a child, everybody that does that deserves to be punished to the fullest extent. Like, I'm mad talking about it because our children, the most innocent, the most innocent and the most beautiful, don't hurt a kid. Absolutely. Okay, back to paranormal. There's also a girl that was apparently murdered at a cemetery surrounding this, and now her ghost, her specter, will be seen. This is terrible. This story, no one wants to go here anyway, especially all of the tragic, tragic events that have occurred here. I mean, my God. Eesh. Let me know in the comments below if you're familiar with this place in Argentina. And if you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe and click the bell to be notified. We're diving in. We're talking about all the creepy places that you don't want to visit. Obviously, this one is at the top of my list currently, even though it's number two. Let's go to number three. Number three, Dragsholm Castle in Zealand, Zealand, Denmark. Not New Zealand. Zealand, Denmark. The place of 100 spirits. The the stories had to have started from somewhere, and it's scary, the tales having been passed down. So. It's somewhere I don't want to visit. Now, I love castles. I love going and seeing the historical buildings and even like forts from wars. And I just don't want to be the person who experiences one of these spirits. Specifically, the tragic love story of the white lady who died in the castle. Her remains were found in the castle and who is said to still haunt said castle. No, thank you. No. Mm -mm. Have you been to Zealand, Denmark? Have you been to New Zealand? Have you been confused in this video thinking that Zealand is New Zealand like me, but it's Zealand, Denmark? Let me know in the comments. You're welcome. Number four, going to my handy dandy notebook for this one. Pella Buhan Ratu, Indonesia. Pella Buhan Ratu, Indonesia. Let me know in the comments. I probably butchered it. Indonesia. The princess of the South Sea, who is said to drown anyone wearing the color green. So if you're in Indonesia, if you're around this place in which I can't pronounce, so you're lucky because you want to go back to this video to research before you go there so that you won't know, so that you, when you are there and you are wearing green, she'll drown you. Don't do that, okay? In Indonesia, there's a place, there's a lady, ocean lady of the seas. She'll drown you. Don't wear green. Just go to Indonesia. Don't wear green. You're safe right? Have you been to Indonesia? Does it sound like I'm saying Indonesia? Indonesia? This list would not be complete without Mount Everest. It has only been summited by a few people, and there are hundreds of places that are the burial site on Mount Everest of people, including Green Boots or Andrew Irvine. This place is riddled with those who have attempted and have failed and have called Mount Everest now their burial place. It is so expensive to get their remains down that they will forever be buried there at Mount Everest or before they get to the peak of Mount Everest. Have you seen those photos? Like it's frozen in time. Hundreds of people attempting to reach the summit. Let me know in the comments. It's it's a very interesting place. Number six, and again, why are these names so difficult? Quinta da Juncosa, Portugal. I feel like that's close enough. Quinta da Juncosa, Portugal. 
It's the place, uh, Tragic Tale, the Baron of Lages? 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 The Baron of Lages? 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 Basically, this guy killed his entire family because he mistook, mistaken his love, his wife, of being unfaithful. And now, because of, there's paranormal activity. You guessed it. Isn't it amazing? For every action, there's a equal but opposite reaction. Of course his wife would haunt the home. She was taken mistakenly. You don't kill people anyway, but she wasn't even being unfaithful. Let me know in the comments if you've heard of this. You probably haven't. Have you been to Portugal, though? Maybe you've been there. Send pictures. Halt. If you've gotten this far, be sure to subscribe. Click the bell to be notified when I release content. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for being you. And check out all the merch that we have available, like streaming my music. That's number 12 at radio right now. Last time, stream it wherever you stream your music. Curtius Fortress? I can't pronounce the words. This in Norway is the most haunted fortress. It's not like there's tons of them everywhere, but apparently this is a very, very haunted place in Norway. Tons of experiences happen, paranormal for a lot of people. A lot of them are corroborated and they correlate with each other. Stories like the demon dog that haunt and protect the place or or the ghost of Mantelgeisten. It's a faceless woman. It's very scary in a robe just... Wandering around, faceless, scaring people. You got a demon dog and a faceless woman. Have you been to Norway? Have you been to the fortress? If you have, you get two gold stars. Let me know in the comments. To the comments. Norwegians, Norwegians, Norway. Hellingly Hospital in the UK. Of course it was once an asylum. And it's known for its poor treatment of individuals. And you can hear painful noises and sounds. And people have all kinds of experiences of heaviness and weight. And that seems to be the recurring theme in these asylums where people weren't tended to, cared for with the manner and dignity that they should have been. And now it's on the list of some of the most chilling places that you don't want to visit. But it seems that people, when you say don't do it, they want to do it and they do it. Have you been to the United Kingdom, to this asylum? Have you experienced this? Have you been near it? Have you been to? Let me know in the comments. To the comments! Reina Sofia Museum and University of Cordova, Spain. This place is riddled with nun ghosts. Nuns. It was once a hospital. Of course, nuns would work at hospitals like Mercy Hospital in Owensboro, Kentucky, where I'm from. I was delivered there. Nuns worked there. Sisters. But this place, now you would think that nuns are spiritual and, and, and religious and very holy people. So if they're haunting this place, haunt then it's probably filled with just lovingly haunts. They, they'll they pray with you and pray for you. I still would not want to see an, a, a place just with nun ghosts walking around. That sounds like a candy. You want a nun ghost? No, I've had too many. My belly kind of hurts. Let me know in the comments below. Do you have a hospital where nuns work? No, I mean, how do you correlate that to a question? Would you rather have a demon dog haunt you or a ghost nun? A nun ghost. Only 100 calories. Calcasieu, what is it? Calcasieu Parish Courthouse? It's in Louisiana. They have all these Louisiana and their parishes, United States of America, USA. The haunting of Tony Joe. This woman is the first woman executed in Louisiana by the electric chair. Now, the unexplained paranormal that happens. Louisiana is filled with paranormal activity, but Specifically, this place, there's all kinds of electrical issues that they can't explain. They've obviously probably had electricians out. And the smell of burnt hair. That smell is a very, very poignant, you know what it is. You're like, that smells like burnt hair. Just like if, well, I won't, yeah. If someone dies in a fire and the smell is of, of someone who's deceased, it smells like a specific smell that I won't get too in detail. Nonetheless, have you been to Louisiana? Have you experienced this? Have you seen electrical issues and smelled burnt hair? Then you've probably seen Tony Joe Henry, interestingly enough. Yeah, if you stuck around this far, thank you. You win five gold stars. I appreciate you. Be sure to subscribe. Click the bell to be notified when I release content. Let me know in the comments below if you've been to any of these 10 places because I won't ever go there ever in a million quadrillion years. And let me know what you'd like me to cover for a future video and maybe just maybe... I will. I talk really fast because it's almost the end of the video and you've probably fallen off by now. But if you haven't, be sure to check out the merch store. Yep. Because while supplies last, I'm sending out some free CDs. CDs. Yep. Check it out. See you at the next video.